Some of the best in ladies' fast pitch softball will be competing on the Gulf Coast. The Sand Dollar Classic is coming to Gulf Shores in February. Kobe Mackin of the Fieldhouse is going to tell us more about the tournament. Kobe, we were just talking, and this is not the first time you and I have talked. We actually filmed a softball segment called Pros vs. Joe about seven <laughs> years ago where you had your players strike me out on television. It was very embarrassing. It was awesome. <laughs> it, it was awesome or embarrassing, depending <laughs> upon any way you slice it. So, and a truly awesome event is coming to Gulf Shores, the first Sand Dollar Classic. Tell us a little bit about what the Sand Dollar Classic is. Well, it's opening weekend for NCAA Division I uh, teams, and so University of Alabama, South Alabama, Southern Miss, several, 12 schools are coming in to start their season in Gulf Shores in February. Very exciting to have all these schools come to one place to kick it off in kind of mm -hmm. a tournament style, the Sand Dollar Classic. Now, this is all taking place at the Field House, and that's where you currently are. Tell the folks, what is the Field House in Gulf Shores? Well, the Field House is in Daphne. It's an indoor facility where we train for baseball and softball private lessons and strength and conditioning and so forth, but the Field House is hosting this tournament down in Gulf Shores. So. That, that's, that's what I meant to say. Right, and right. it's all taking place down there in Gulf Shores. Now, how did this come to be where we got all these huge NCAA D1 schools to come together for this event? I'm sure tons of planning went into this. Right. I was at um, a camp with Pat Murphy, the head coach at Alabama, a couple years ago, and he said that he had heard that the Gulf Shores facilities were the nicest in the state, but he'd never been there. And I was mm -hmm. like, well, you should come. And he said, okay, have a tournament and I will. So here we are. Here we are. So the event is not not taking place until the first week of February, but for the folks, we wanted to get the information out to them now so you can start planning to show up. What do they need to know if they want to come out to an event such as this, the Sand Dollar Classic? Well, tickets are already on sale at our website, trainatthefieldhouse.com, mm -hmm. so they can go online and get tickets. Um, it's going to be all weekend, Thursday through Sunday. They're going to get to see all the teams. There's going to be meet and greet. They're going to be able to sign autographs, and we're expecting a huge crowd. And so we want you to plan now because usually that's when the weather starts to pick up and get a little bit nicer as well. So it's mm -hmm. going to be great weather. The Sand Dollar Classic down there. You can spend a weekend at the beach and see some of the best uh, lady softball players in the country. Uh, play in the Sand Dollar Classic. Is there anything else we need to touch on that we haven't talked about yet? Well, I just if, if you're looking for a last-minute Christmas bit gift at the Fieldhouse, we have T-Ball Camp. We have mm -hmm. all kinds of special events coming up, so check out our website, trainatthefieldhouse.com. And actually, we're going to have a link to that website on our Studio 10 page. I put mm -hmm. the link to that so you have all the information about the Sand Dollar Classic and the Fieldhouse, the best of both worlds. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you. Sounds like it's going to be a great event early in February. Coming up